Hey guys, this is Versatile from Game Next In today's video tutorial, I'm going to show you how simple it is to play Dune 2000 online. And yes, I found a portable version. I want to thank user, Tungle user, Digital Master for showing me the light. And on his um, website that's offering this portable download. And if you go to the more info section or if you go to the Game Dexterity wiki page, I'll have a link to the actual game. So if you're using the wiki, that's cool. Go to Dune 2K Portable. And this is Windows 7 compatible with X64, 64 bit machines. And then you go to this hum. Yo site, and you can here you can download the Dune 2K 1.06, and if the link is ever broken, let me know, and I'll upload the game in the future. So basically, you unzip the game, right? So when you unzip the game, you get this directory with all these different files, and what you go, what you want to do is you go to the LAN patch, copy the two DLL files, and extract them in the root here, and then respectively, make sure you run the respective registry file. Whether you're Windows 32-bit, run this one. If you're running Windows 64-bit, then run this guy, and then you're good to go. So when you run the game, what's going to happen is um, it's going to prompt you which network connection do you want to use. Now, right now, I'm inside this Tungle program. Tungle is a VPN gaming program. If you want to learn more about it, I'll leave a comment, and I'll teach you all about that program. But basically, here I am in the Tungle program. It's like a VPN gaming program. helps you play LAN online with other players. So... Here I am in Tungle Room. Here I select whatever connection I want to use. So this is my Tungle IP address. If you want to use your internal LAN, that's fine. Select this address and then press OK. So with that said, let's jump straight into the gameplay video. All right, so in this portion of the video, we'll show you how to join a game. So let's go to multiplayer game. And then we are going to go to LAN. Afterwards, we see that digital game is hosting. So I'm just going to join his game, click on the Join button. And basically, I just wait here and wait for him to do whatever settings that he needs to do. Once you're ready and you accept, click on the accept button and then the host will likewise click on his accept button and then the game will start. So it's pretty simple. Um, if you ever have issues joining someone else's game, make sure that if you're using Tungle that you port forward UDP 11155. Sweet, so here we are in the well, game. If you want to chat to someone, yes, press the F1 key yes, and then you can chat to that respective other player. So with that said, let's jump into the next portion of the video that shows you how to host a game. So here we are. I'll show you how to host a game. It's pretty simple. So go to multiplayer game, go to LAN. Once you're in the LAN menu and once you have all your players, what you do is just click on the new button and then you're hosting your game automatically. Set up your options, whatever you want it to do. Change your handicap settings as necessary. Add AIs, click on accept after the other players click accept and you're good to go. If you want to type to someone, press the F1 key, type whatever you want, press uh, enter and you're good to go and your message is sent out to that particular player. So with that said, let's go straight back to the desktop. So we can clearly see that the game works fine. I'm using Tungle. You don't have to use Tungle. You can use Hamachi or whatever program you want to use. And you can also do it on your own internal LAN network. If you got any questions, go ahead and leave a comment here on the YouTube page and I'll get back to you as soon as possible. Once again, thank you for watching. Take care. Bye.